hey hi guys welcome back to my channel step campus in this video we are going to see drag and drop functionality so in previous t12 track uh, in the hands on so the element team has asked us to perform one functionality that is drag and drop so that is basically a website where we have some items okay so once we uh, drag the items into the cart area so one button will enable and then we have to proceed with that element okay so this is a basic scenario so for example we will considering the same thing so suppose this is a cart area okay so this is a cart area this is the items okay and suppose uh, this is a button for example suppose this is a button and this button is disabled at this moment why disable because there is nothing in the cart area so this is disable so once we drag and drop any items into the cart area so this button will enable and then we will click on this element and then we will go to the uh, payment section okay so this is the basic scenarios so how to perform this drag and drop functionality we will see here okay so let's go uh, to the editor okay compiler uh, id we will create one class we will give drag and drop okay and we will select this public static void main as well so that we can run our test cases now now first what we have to do we have to invoke our browser okay we have to initialize the driver and then we will invoke our browser so web driver driver equals to new chrome driver okay now import this web driver and import this chrome driver as well okay now we will do two basic command the first one is maximizing the window and second one uh, timeouts okay so driver dot manage okay dot timeouts dot implicit weight okay so first initialize the implicit weight and here we have to give duration dot of seconds we have to choose if you are aware, not aware about this one so you have to go and watch the lecture from the starting so that we can understand what i am writing here okay so this is basically implicit weight now we have to maximize the window as well so driver dot manage dot window and then we have to use maximize okay so the window will maximize now so to perform any action to this website we have to go to this website right so we will copy this url okay we will write driver dot get and then we will pass our url here okay just save it run one more time let's see uh, it is opening browser or not okay uh, maxim window is maximized now we can see this website is open now just close this one now what we have to do okay so see first manually okay what we have to do now we have uh, this is a source item okay and this is a target area so the source item should be placed in the target area okay this is a this is the uh, idea to uh, idea behind the drag and drop okay so there will be one source element and there will be one target element and we have to drag and drop the source to the target okay so control shift i so we will first uh, find the element of this area so suppose i am going to uh, uh, add this red item here okay so copy this one i will use xpath slash slash div at the rate class equals to this value okay so now you can see unique element so control a control c and because this is a web element so we will store this in web element variable web element okay i will give src as a source equals to driver dot find element okay by dot we are using xpath right and we will paste here so this is a source uh, we have to import web element as well now copy the same line okay paste there uh, paste in a different line now make it trg that is target so this is the cart area cart area means target so hover this element uh, we have a target uh, id so we will go with the id web element okay and here we have to give id okay so now source and target is there now what we have to do so we have to we have to drag the source into the target area right so for this one we have we have to use one class that is actions class so give actions i will give name as a you can give any name equals to new actions so this is a class so to use any class variables uh, methods we have to 
create a object first okay so we are creating object here okay and inside this one we have to pass driver okay now import this extension as well now a dot okay what we have to do drag and drop right so we you can see here once you write dot so ide automatically give you suggestion drag and drop okay so we have to two option drag and drop by also and drag and drop also so we will go with the basic uh, drag and drop okay uh, automatically you can see this src and target are automatically filled here okay and after this what we have to do we have to give dot build okay dot build build dot dot perform okay dot build dot perform okay so this is a full command so we are saying that yeah go drag and drop and then we have to build this one build this one and perform this action so we have to use this whole command okay and save it okay and uh, right click on this one run as java application let's see it is dragging and uh, dragging and dropping or not okay so website opened in the full mo of a, uh, that is maximize window and you can see here right element move to the cart area right so i hope this is clear to you guys how to perform this uh, activity okay so yeah we'll see you in the next lecture thank you bye bye